Hi, I'm Rez, and today we are going to be pulling on the Eight and King banner. Um, I don't have any particular attachment to either of these characters. I've never played Type Zero. Um, Eight's kit sounds kind of cool. So does King's, honestly, but his hair really bothers me. Like, I know it's supposed to be a faux hawk, but to me it just looks like a mullet, and I don't know how I feel about that. But, um, we're not gonna go too hard on this banner. We're gonna do the free multi and maybe a few tickets. Um, I wanna make sure that my resources are in good shape for uh, Aranea, which I think will be in just about a week, maybe? Uh, no, it'll be a week from Sunday, I think. That's when it'll be. Um, but yeah, so I wanted to say um, thank you so much for the feedback on uh, my unit showcase video. Um, I really, really appreciate it. I'm so glad that the stories were entertaining for some of you. Um, so I'll edit and put up the one for the 6060 characters um, soon. But it was a lot of fun making the video. I had a lot of fun choosing the music and setting it to all the characters. So um, anyway, uh, without further ado, let's get started. Great. So, let's see, how many tickets do we have? We've got, oh, actually not bad at all. And then, okay, so, Brothers ended tonight and I didn't, I got to master a lot of folks, so I didn't, I decided to, you know, deprioritize folks that are gonna be getting boosted um, during this month, so like Tara and Zach. Uh, so I've still got a ton of folks to collect resources from and like I said a few videos ago I like to do it all in one go just to just to be able to see oh look I have 20k more gems from all the work that I did over like the last two weeks but um yeah so I know when we ended Golvez I think we were at just about 100 tickets so I'm glad we're at least at like you know 145 so let's say um we will go down to 125 after we do the free multi and I'm not gonna load the uh, I'm not gonna load the weapons because I don't I don't care that much, um, and it could be so many weapons at this point. Um, so it'll be a surprise. It'll be a surprise either way. I also I only have one copy of Quistus's 35, so if I get more copies of those, great. All right, so we are gonna jump in. Okay, double connecting, so we're getting at least at least one of eight's weapons or King's EX. Let's go. Two, Oh, oh, okay, lit, oh my god, great. That's, uh, that would have been the EX that I wanted from this banner. So I guess the lesson is, um, say you don't really, you don't, you know, you're not, uh, you don't really care one way or the other if you get the EX, but I was kind of hoping I'd get it. His kit seems like a lot of fun, so I'm really excited. Um, so that's great. I'm very happy about that. Let's hope that I didn't use up all my free luck uh, before Aranea. And um, I'll still be throwing a few tickets at Ignis, but So let's go ahead and do 20 tickets and then we'll be done. So I did decide that I am gonna stream, um, I am gonna do a live stream of FF4 and I think I'm gonna do the first one on um, Monday around like 8, 8.30 Eastern time. Um, and then, you know, after doing that, I'll decide whether or not I wanna keep live streaming it, but either way, I'll post the video afterwards. So um, if you guys will be able to join, I would love to see you there. Uh, like I said, FF4 was one of the first Final Fantasy games that I ever played, but I never beat it. And I played it so long ago that I actually don't remember a lot of the plot, so um, I'm I'm excited to kind of replay uh, to to be able to replay it. I think the problem with um, you know being an RPG 
gamer is, oh, gold, okay. It didn't do the connecting screen, I don't think, so I don't think we'll get his 35. Of course. I got so many of these. I can't, I think he was on Vane's, I think he was on Vane's banner and I had to pity Vane and I got so many effing judgments. But yeah, so there are so many games that I wish I could experience for the first time again. Tales of Symphonia, Chrono Trigger, um, I'm, I'm drawing a blank, let's see, FF6. Even though I played FF6 for the first time like a couple years ago, I would love to be able to play those games again. So I remember how much I loved FF4 when I played it, but I don't remember much of the story. I remember a lot of the music but I don't remember much of the story. So um, I'm very excited to be able to, oh, gold, okay. Okay, at least we don't have this maxed. Or maybe we do and I just never use the orbs to totally max it out. I hope I don't sound unappreciative uh, for getting um, eights EX on the free multi. I'm, I hope people aren't mad at me for that. I hope all of you get the same luck. But I went out to dinner tonight um, to celebrate and went to my favorite restaurant. And uh, whenever I go to the restaurant, because it's like a very special deal, whenever I go, I very rarely go. I always get two entrees and then take half of each home. Um, but I'm so full as a result, even just from eating half of both, because they're both like very he heavy uh, pasta dishes. But I'm set for leftovers to the weekend, so I'm very happy. I also realized that in the video yesterday, um, I was holding my glass of, and I was drinking rum actually, uh, last night or two nights ago when I was recording the unit showcase. I realized that I was holding it the entire time and I never actually took a sip while I was recording. So. I just looked kind of foolish holding a glass of rum the entire time. Um, a few people asked me, you know, what exactly I was drinking uh, during, I think, maybe my Colbez pull video. Um, it wasn't straight whiskey. Uh, I usually just drink straight rum, um, and the only time I drink straight whiskey is uh, when I've got really good whiskey that I usually can like steal from my dad or something. Um, but I usually make myself an old fashioned. Um, I'm quite good at making them if I do say so myself. Uh, but I mean, there's like three ingredients, so it's not, it's not too hard, but that's usually what I'm, what I'm drinking on a stream or a video or when, when I did stream on Twitch, I was often found with a glass of whiskey while playing. All right. So two more tickets. Are we going to be able to get his 35? I don't think so but no problem. If not, we can always just token. But now I gotta like familiarize myself with his kit and uh, you know, decide whether or not I should, um, I should plus him or max him or anything. So um, if any of you guys have any suggestions on what to, on whether or not I should invest in him, um, especially I guess knowing like who my party members are right now, um, would love any advice there. So um, I think that's gonna be it for this video. I don't wanna go too hard on it, but I'm happy. I'm glad that we got uh, 8ZX because he does see, his kit does seem like a lot of fun. Um, so, and then did we, I can't remember if we did end up getting Aquistus 35. Either way, we ended up getting, I think it was a pretty good haul for the amount of resources that we spent. So um, I think that'll be it. So uh, let's see, let's go back. Yeah, so I think um, I'll probably post the 6060 uh, unit showcase um, probably sometime over the weekend before the Ignis banner drops. And then um, Sunday we'll pull for Ignis, probably the same deal um, depending on, I don't know that much about Ignis's kit, I recently found out that he, uh, he's kind of like Lena in that he, um, you get debuff immunity with him, which like, I like that a lot, so I might go for more than a few tickets with him, but I also already have Zach, so I'm not sure, but um, Besides that, then on Monday we will do the uh, live FF4 stream around 8, 8.30 Eastern. So 
I'll figure out how to put a countdown on uh, my YouTube channel and uh, uh, hopefully see you guys there. I've never done a live stream via YouTube before, so uh, bear with me if it ends up, you know, if I end up getting technical difficulties or something. But um, wanted to say again, thank you so much for the support. Uh, I'm almost at 800 subscribers and I'm just overwhelmed with how incredible this community is like i you know even when i was a lurker um i always loved how positive and supportive the community was but now being a being a you know semi-content creator um it's it's been really great getting to know some of you and i can't tell you how much i appreciate all the support so thank you so much um and hope to see you soon